How you doing guys, this is Liam here. Um, just a quick video. Uh, this is my office. Now I know what you're going to think, like what's going on here? Well this is my office, uh, for the cleaner's office, because I mean, that's what I do for a living, I'm a cleaner. It's only a tiny one. Now basically the reason why I'm showing you this video is because I'm going to show you what I do for a living. And if, uh, I don't even think I can say it around, uh, but if I could just flip it, Oh, I've got my brightness on, so it's going to basically blind me. Whoa, Jesus. Okay, right. So I'm going to try not to look at... Well, I have no choice, but I'm going to have to start looking at the camera. Uh, so, how are you doing? Well, this is Liam. Hallows Riddle. Uh, basically, this is just a, a really short video. Uh, just to show you what I actually do for a living, like where the magic happens, obviously, when you get paid and stuff. Uh, I work at the Preston train station. If anyone's familiar with Preston train station, uh, let me know in the comment section. Don't forget as well, smash those like buttons. And I'll just give you a little bit of a little bit of a, a look in the office. So I'm just going to turn the camera around again. Okay, right. So I'm leaving the office now. So this is what I clean. So at the moment, I'm actually stood on platform three, and that is my office right there clean his office I'm just turning you around that's my little trolley there it looks like a, a barbecue on steroids so there we go so this is what I do as you can see it's really early hours in the morning it's 6 35 exactly and yeah this is what I clean over there on that side it's platform one and two right over there that's what I clean all that you got a little office over there that's where I leave my bags and just there where my finger is, I don't even know if I can zoom in. Right there is where we change the bags. Fairly simple. And if I just come this side, I mean, obviously people, uh, I mean, I see thousands of people every week, thousands. And yesterday, being a Saturday, football was on and it was absolutely heaving. Proper heaving. So I'm just going to, there's a lift. Platform three and four, they go behind it, and we clean all the way right down there, right down to the bottom. And that's five and six over there. All that, clean all the way down there. Whatever rubbish that we find, there's a lift again for five and six. That's benches, that's the, uh, we call it the horseshoe. And we've got a horseshoe right there. We clean all that. Poster boards. Yeah, basically, I'm just showing you, like, what I do for a living. And uh, I'm sorry if this camera is a little bit wonky. It is early hours in the morning. I've not really woke up properly yet. There we go. Can you see me? Got some mirrors in on the doors. Can you see me? Hello. <laughs> and just at the top up here is Starbucks. Let's see if I can get a bit closer. Well, yeah, this is what I do. And uh, altogether, I've been here for <clears throat> 14 years. Well, 12 years on here, two years at Lancaster Station. And uh, left, tried a couple of other jobs, didn't work out. And uh, I don't know what it is about this station, but it just kind of pulls you back. And it's like, yeah, come and work with me. And uh, here I am. But the job's not really that hard, to be honest, guys. It's only hard if you make it hard for yourself uh, or if it's really, really busy. There you go, there's Starbucks. I believe that they're going to extend this. They're going to get rid of that and put another one there, a new one. Because this one at the moment just looks like a massive square box anyway. But this place used to be Britazza. But now it's a Starbucks for the past few years. Fake plant. <laughs> another fake, fake plant. There we go. That over there is like a bus shelter, but it's not. It's just somewhere that you can sit down. But that was never there when I left. That's the bunker area. And we call that the fish tank where the people just hang out, have anti-staff basically. And they do all the work in there and stuff. Uh, so this is what I'm on. Platform four. And over there, obviously over there is number five and six. So it goes seven right at the top. That's never in use. The only time they use that is when they just practice the trains up and down to make the shoot. Basically just test the trains. So that's seven, six, five, four and then three is the other side two one and your front entrance is just up that way you see those lights at the top 
that's the front entrance, and all over this bridge is Butler Street. Obviously, you've got your stairs there. So, yeah, this is what I do. So, you can imagine that you've got to clean this bad boy a lot. Plus, you've got toilets as well to clean. That's another uh, coffee shop right there called Gourmet, but that used to be West Cornwall Pasties. Um, but that, that left because of Covid. It couldn't handle it, you see. Uh, so now it's the Gourmet coffee bar and kitchen place. And... I've just heard a noise then from the wires. You see the wires up there? And that's a disabled area as well. That's kind of new. And that's one and two right there, four boxes there, and that's Northern Office right over there, zoom in. Right there, sometimes we clean that. Just empty bins and stuff like that and give it a wipe down. That's pumpkin area, that's been there for donkey's years. And I think they're gonna change that to something else, guys, but I'm not 100%. Cafe shop. There we go, sometimes we have to clean those whiteboards. There we go, team leader's office up there, at the top. And that's your train times, obviously. Let's see what's going on. We've got Colm cancelled. And Blackpool South cancelled already. And it's only Sunday morning, guys. Only Sunday morning. I'm gonna see if I I'm gonna see if I can show you the toilets now. So this is the waiting room area. Waiting room area. There we go. Like the benches are different from through the years. I'm sure there used to be red benches in there. But they're all locked off at the moment because it's only early. I don't think we open up till about 7.30 in the morning. That's the disabled toilet. That's me again. Right, and let's see, I've got a pair of keys. Hang on. So I left my keys in the door. There they are. So we can get them out yet. Just lock that for a minute. I'll just put that there like that. Because there's no one here anyway, so we're quite safe. I'll right, get the other set of keys. Oh yeah, there's a disabled as well. Disabled talent. So we can get these keys. You probably look at me as they say, what, what are you doing? You know what I mean? Show me, show me. Okay. That's the right set. That's good, mate. So these are the toilets. Okay. Let's leave them in the door for a minute. Okay, so these are the toilets. This is a solution room in there. And these are the male toilets. CCTV in operation. Now, we do have problems sometimes with these toilets because because it's really old, um, the drains are not keeping up with what's going on. Because they're really old, you know what I mean? Like the proper range and all, like I'm talking 200 years old drainage, you know what I mean? 200, pound, uh, 200 years old um, pipe work. There you go. I mean, it's not a pleasant thing just to show you this, but this is what I do for a living. I clean all this side, make sure the taps are clean, uh, clean under here, under these here. And then once you've done in here, you walk out and then go to the ladies. There we go. Ladies are just here. You can see, look, these are still here. Protect yourself and others. Stay two metres apart. Still here, guys. Ladies. Now, it's always quite embarrassing when you come in the ladies because I always shout, uh, cleaner, you know, so they know it's a block because <laughs> I've got a deep voice, of course. So, yeah, there you go. These are the toilets for the ladies. I'm not going to spend too much time in here because I've, you know, I, I just don't like going in here normally. I've been here for years, but I just don't like it. It's weird. I feel like a, a bit of a weird. And this is the waiting room. This is inside the waiting room now. That's the disabled. And obviously you've got your, what, you know, like what's going on in Preston, what's going on in Manchester, Blackpool, Southport, anywhere really. And you've got your new 2023 zoo, Blackpool Zoo, the perfect days, perfect days out. Award winners. We've got loads of kind of stuff here. Look, Brock Hall's here. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Adventures for kids for day out. That's not bad. They've got it all here, guys. British Commercial Vehicle Museum. That sounds good. Flower Bowl. That looks really nice, that picture. Yeah, they've got all kinds of stuff going on. That one's obviously empty. Well, that's quite interesting there. Have a read of that if you want to pause it. Quite interesting. Yeah, I always find it quite important to find out 
like where you work, wherever you work, you want to find out a little bit about it, like the history of it. Like Preston train station has been here for well over 200 years. It's ancient old. So you can imagine that it's in some arch, you know what I mean? It's in some action. All right, so that's me leaving now. I'll just close this. There we go. That's it. So there you have it, guys. There you have it. This is where I work. And I do enjoy the job, to be fair with you. It's, it's not bad. It's only odd, like I said, if uh, someone makes it hard for you and everyone has their own style of working. And, uh, yeah, it's... Uh, it's pretty cushy, so don't forget, smash those like buttons if you like what you see, and don't forget as well, leave in the comment section if you like what you see, or if you've worked here before, that'd be interesting, like, you know, the old staff, like, say, five years ago, even even 20 years ago, you know, even further back than that, and you can tell me what's changed and what's not changed, because I know that a lot has changed here, even just through 10 years, because this floor that you're looking at, that was never here when I would, when I started. It was just all, all one floor, all one lined, smooth surface floor. Where now it's all stoned. You can see where the gaps are. You can see all the gaps. But it's not good for the machines because obviously we have to use machines for this to clean their buffer machines. And I believe we've got three buffer machines. To be fair with you, we've got a sit down right now, and we've always wanted to sit down right for years, but nothing ever got done of it. So yeah, this is a uh, Preston train station in the year 2023 so how about that so let me know in the comment section again guys tell me what you think have a good one bye bye